Well, the weather forecaster has promised us an agreeable day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And we have live action from the Bundesliga coming right up. It's Bochum versus Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. And the starting 11 for Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And they kick off here. Rode. Here's Gutsen now. Well, the home side low on confidence in front of goal. Just look at their statistics. They have the worst attack in the league, Stuart. Well, I'm not surprised by their lack of goals. Their approach play is far too predictable. It lacks invention and guile, which makes it almost impossible for the forwards to find space. And I can't see that changing today. Now, how about the short corner? And he takes it on, able to get a body in the way. A promising Mario Goetze run here. Just the clearance that was needed. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Can he finish? Brilliant save. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. And just making the run a bit too early. Offside as a result. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Christian Jakic. Jakic. Lindström. Rode now. Gibril So. And possession lost by Frankfurt. And support available. Now oh, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. Koro Muani. Rode now. Good sir. Oh, he's through here. Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again.
Who can they pick out? And did his job defensively. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Can they hit on the break? And he's won the ball. Jesper Lindström. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Well, sloppy in possession. Now potential danger. Lucia. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Now they'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Well, that's not great, is it? There's been a real lack of quality in the game. The passing's been too safe, and there hasn't been enough movement from the front players. The recipe for a poor spectacle. So the half-time whistle, and the two teams have just about matched each other stride for stride. What have you made of our hosts? Well, we discussed their lack of goals at the start of the game, and nothing has changed my opinion during that first half. They just lack invention in their forward play. The only saving grace at the moment is their defending, which has been really good. And the match is underway. The keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Very quick thinking there. Kamada. Well, he went strongly into the challenge and the result is a throw-in. Mario Götze. Kolo Muani. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Could be a chance to break here. Might really be able to trouble them here. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. They take it short. He takes aim. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Really good challenge. Can he finish? And the keeper did more than enough.
Short corner favoured. And cleared away. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. Lucia. Tremendous intuition to win it back. They've given it away. Koro Muani. Just ten minutes to go. He has teammates around him. Well, do they have it in them to level this? And that is going to be a free kick. Well, he's gone into the referee's notebook. And he can't be surprised. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Well, not one, Stuart, that's going to live long in the memory. Well, I think the manager might disagree, Derek. Any way you cut it, it's a wasted opportunity. Well, they have the ball once more. And we've entered the final five minutes. Jesper Lindström. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Lost into the penalty area. On a time for composure on the ball. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, I'm not sure how they're going to change things. There's no real pace in the team. They're not playing with any invention. And they just haven't got any game changers at the moment. They never really look like getting back into this game. And the contest begins 